Good evening, everybody. We're tracking some rain showers for you at this hour. They've been around kind of all day, right? Well, they're slowly moving out of here. You see the most organized rain now is north of Brazil up to Interstate 74 about Crawfordsville, scattered about to the south throughout portions of Sullivan and Southern Clay and western portions of Green County at this hour. Big picture shows us temperatures. Well, they're not actually warm, but for this time of year, these temperatures are a little bit warmer than average. We're doing 39 in Paris, 39 in Rockville, 41 in Terre Haute. We've been in the 50s, though, the past few days. Temperatures get in the 50s again tomorrow. So again, we do see temperatures get a little bit warmer before they get a whole lot colder. Now, here's the big picture. There's still some rain back out here in central Illinois. Even within that, we've actually had some of this little mixed precipitation back here. Now, we are not forecasting a lot of slick spots tonight. Matter of fact, we're looking for a lot of this to dry up before it gets a chance to change over into anything that would become very slick or anything like that. But we're going to keep some scattered rain around through the evening hours tonight. Your thunderstorm threat, which we monitored all weekend long. I don't know if you noticed this, but today for a few hours, there was a severe thunderstorm watch just south of Davies and Martin counties. Believe it or not, it's December. And we were talking severe weather in southern Indiana. That's all off to the south and to the east. Not going to bother us for this evening. All right, let's run through future cast. Let me show you what's out there. This this all essentially moves out of here. So that being said, we get into some sunshine tomorrow. 7 a.m. still going to be chilly temperatures, mid 30s. Your winds will be out of the west. We go through the afternoon tomorrow. Not a bad day and looking pretty good. We'll have a mixture of some clouds, some sunshine, but the temperatures. Well, they're going to warm up in the lower 50s. Reason is we're going to have some strong southwesterly winds. We got another cold front moving in. What that's going to do for us again, what that's going to do is bring back a chance for rain showers by Wednesday, but ahead of it, it warms us up in a hurry. So while we're a little bit cooler now, we don't get a chance to stay cold because we warm up tomorrow afternoon, cool off for Thursday or Wednesday morning. Rather, it's Wednesday afternoon and evening where it gets interesting. Watch this. I'm going to widen out just a little bit here and you'll see back out here to the west. There were some areas of snow showers. That's a large area of low pressure. That's going to make things a little interesting for us. You'll see your seven day forecast here just about 20 seconds. So tonight 34 rains exiting. OK, we warm up to 52 tomorrow. Windy and mild with winds out of the southwest. So actually pretty mild tomorrow. 33 tomorrow night. Then we get a chance for a wintry mix on Thursday as temperatures will cool off. My, my real concern is going to be Wednesday evening at 55 degrees in a cold front. We have a chance. We have a chance. I'll be at a small one right now, but we have a chance for some more thunderstorms to move through. Round definitely something that we've got to keep an eye on.